There is a long weekend in November when the Apex Summit comes to town. So if anybody is planning for going on a long drive during vacation or to take advantage of the Apex holidays, here are some tips on our motoring forum. The government has declared a really long holiday for Manila when heads of state and hundreds of delegates from countries will be in the metropolis for the Asian Pacific Economic Cooperation Summit. November 17 to 20 are public holidays in Metro Manila as part of efforts to secure the APEC Summit and ensure everyone's safety and security. Many may be planning to have road trips out of the metro to escape APEC Circus. Motoring Forum believes it is a perfect time to discuss safety motoring tips for long weekends of driving. We are picking up a number of motoring tips and advices from a few websites, including www.wheels.ca, www.insurancehotline.com, and www.shine.com.au, and adapting some to local conditions or the occasion. Motorists who plan on just moving around the metropolis, they are well advised to know where the cemeteries are in the metro and plan trips accordingly. For those joining the exodus out of the metro to the provinces, here are some tips, suggestions, and advice. Check over your car. It's important to check your vehicle over before travel. Road safety bodies generally recommend the power check. Power stands for patrol or fuel, oils, water, electric, and rubbers or tires. Concentration and mental preparation. Getting a good night's sleep before your journey is very important. Plan ahead and accept that it may take a little longer than you expected to reach your destination. Drink plenty of water and take a short break every two hours to help improve your concentration. Be courteous. Share the road and try to control any frustration. Allow other drivers to merge or change lanes easily. Use your horn as a warning sound only, not out of frustration. Be aware of the needs of other drivers and road users like pedestrians, cyclists, motorcyclists, and heavy vehicles. Be mindful of stopping distances. Always leave a suitable gap between you and the vehicle in front. Be careful of trucks and other road vehicles that usually need more time to stop. Weather should also be taken into consideration as stopping in the rain or wet requires more time. Don't drive distracted. Put your phones on airplane mode and let your passengers select the music for the drive. Plan your itinerary. Set your route ahead of time and have a plan B and plan C just in case there's a collision that causes traffic to come to a slow crawl. Downloading the Waze app is a great suggestion. Look for less traveled routes. Major highways are everyone's route of choice. Try some of the smaller highways. In addition to less traffic, you'll also be treated to some colorful scenery. If you find the high volume of long weekend traffic too stressful, try leaving earlier or later than the mass exodus. If you have no choice, take some time before you set out to tell yourself traffic will be very busy, just go with the flow. Allowing oneself to become stressed out and aggressive will only make it worse. Driving with less aggression and more care will be safer, less stressful, and you will save on fuel and maintenance costs, and more importantly, health maintenance costs. Be smart and take your time packing your vehicle for the drive. Do not overload your vehicle or block your vision. If your vehicle is packed to its limit, check your tire pressure and inflate to the recommended pressure for heavy loads. Don't tailgate. When traffic comes to a halt, you'll have plenty of time to slow gradually and the vehicle behind you is less likely to run into you. Prepare as well for going home. Perform all the necessary planning, vehicle checks that you undertook at the outset of the long weekend of driving. Be aware of driver fatigue. You may have just spent a long day playing and then packing and these activities can tire you out. Put in your mind that long weekend traffic will almost be slow moving. There is no point trying to make up time by driving aggressively. And always think of safety first before anything else. Sometimes we all forget why we plan vacations for the holidays and that is to refresh ourselves through rest and relaxation and some recreation. Stressing ourselves on the road won't help but diminish our enjoyment of the holidays.